And we're back with another knife review. This week we're going to do a request from a person on a, I can't remember if it was Instagram or it might have been YouTube. Asked if uh got a note saying he wanted us to do the flashbang. Uh, the only flashbangs that I currently had close where I could find were the original ones. Now they also have them in uh, you know N690 and uh, different designs on the handle now and I believe these two are actually going to be discontinued if they haven't been already. But we'll start off with these. They all have the same specs except when it comes to the blade steel on the N690. So this is the Kaiser Vanguard flashbang. It's a G10 handle. Overall length 7.25 the blade length is about three inches. It's a VG10, so it's a decent little steel. It's the designed by my buddy Matt, uh, Matt Cucciara. It has a clip point blade, a hollow grind, satin finish. The handle is four and a quarter. Of course, this one's green. There's a black one. There's about three or four other versions. It's very light at 2.86 ounces. Has that flow through look. Also has a barrel spacers on the back side. Pocket clip, tip up carry. Very smooth flipper has ceramic ball bearings for its pivot. This one has a liner that's stainless steel. It's set up for right hand. The black one has all the same features. G10 scales. The liner is uh, skeletonized. Uh, there's holes drilled in the liner on both sides. No, wait, both sides. On the front side to make it a little bit lighter help take away some of that uh, weight but under three ounces is uh, already fairly light this is a nice little everyday carry as you can see it's very smooth open and deployment you can see it in my hand at seven and a quarter inches we'll go ahead and show you how it cuts We'll use the black one. We'll start off with some paracord. Cuts through that pretty easily. Pull back cut. Also cuts through that. If anybody has any requests when they're watching our video, simply uh, yeah, just contact us, send an email, or uh, if you don't use email, send a DM and one of the people that run the social media pages will let us know and if we have it around we'll try our best to do it I can't remember who asked this one um, I wish I could but I don't know if they actually told me As you can see it cuts through that which is some burlap pretty easily We'll go ahead and cut some cardboard here. We'll start at the tip and work our way to the back of the blade. Oops, that's my fault. So it cuts fairly easy. We'll go through it, pull across, cuts through there. Oops, that's my fault again. I should probably stop doing that. So you can see it cuts pretty good. Pretty much any blade above uh, 440 is going to cut whenever you need it to. Show you the action on that one again. Close it up. I like the flipper on this. It has a nice little uh, jimping on it so your finger doesn't slide off because it is at an angle as you can tell there has nice ergonomics to this knife. The uh, screws 
or inset into the handle. And I like the pocket clip. Gives you that place to rest the edge of your jean pocket right in there is to keep that fraying from happening. So I think we about covered everything here with the uh, I forgot what this thing was called. The Kershaw Vanguard Flashbang. That's it. I like this knife and I couldn't remember. On that note, if you're watching on Instagram, make sure you uh, like and follow at Atlantic Knife. If you're watching on YouTube, give us one of those big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. You can watch our weekly show which Jewel and I do on every Friday night. It's not only informative about all the new knives. Hell, it's pretty funny. On that note, I am C with Atlantic Knife, signing off.